Today we're back looking at more Karen's. If I am correct, this is going to be the last video of 2023. So it's the last Karen video of 2023. I can guarantee you there will be many more in 2024. You did help me out and move. Oh. Oh, I've seen this before. What's this? Well, that's certainly one way to get a broken fist. One thing for certain is that he's definitely going to feel that later. Within the space of about one minute, his fist is slowly going to start throbbing. Have you ever went over from your ankle and you can literally feel the pain in it throbbing? That is going to be his fist. Oh, why are you dragging the dog like that? Okay, so I think that woman threw a piece of dog poo at him. Put it this way, if you're gonna walk around and throw dog poo at people, you're gonna get slapped. So don't be running to police screaming and crying, sweetheart, because you're the one he calls to. You won't believe what happened on my flight to LA. What are you talking to me like that for? Take me off. I don't give a I didn't even want to go to Cali. I didn't even want to go to Cali. I didn't even want to go to Cali. Apparently, he doesn't want to go to Cali. I'm talking to you. I will find your name, date, and birth. An address. I will know your social security number before I get off this plane. On my daughter. On that same baby that you see me on the, on the phone with. What? What? So what the? Yo, yo, cuss. What's the, I wonder what this argument the, is over. What's the plane? What they gonna do for you before I came? What's the law gonna do? Wait, he's arguing with. Because I'm flight attendant. Let me just explain something. Hold on. Let me explain something. What did the flight attendant do? It's no need, huh? You told me one thing. I told you I'm gonna leave alone. Gangsta I'm leaving alone. You're leaving alone. Gangsta, you talking to me? Gangsta, there's no need. Huh? Yo, you about to go. This shit is fucking. Two hours late, man. I'm trying to leave, bro. Shit, two hours late. And I'm sitting here waiting two hours later, bro. Okay, well, I just want to know what they're arguing over. I thought he was arguing with another passenger. He's arguing with flight attendant. A bold one as well. Like, leave the poor flight attendant alone. Welcome to the new fly list. Bus rides and trains will take you hours today. Exactly. Like, is it literally worth getting an altercation like that? Because you're just going to get banned. I mean, he did talk about how he doesn't even go to Cali, so it looks like his dreams are going to come true. It's appropriate. It comes down to about top of her knees. So you're sitting here calling me fat? Oh, you don't think you are? No, because I love who I am. I'm sorry. No, you get, get the out of my face. I don't have to. And don't swear at me like that. I don't give a I do. That's your problem. I do give But you don't. Obviously. Don't come back on that stage with those shorts. I'm warning you. Who are you? Who are you? Who you read my name? I say that, but who are you to tell me what I'm supposed to no, do? No, voice. get the out of my face! Quit swearing at me. Get out! Don't talk. I am not. Okay, so I thought that she was maybe at school. She's literally at church. Oh god, that is not good. Yet again, notice how the old woman played the victim at the end. She was going over and acting all shocked and everything. You're gonna get a reaction like that if you go up to somebody and fat shame them. Apparently she was wearing shorts and she looked fat in them. Who cares? She's at church. She's literally there to worship God. The rage I'm feeling right now, you did so well stand up for yourself. It must have been traumatizing for you. Exactly, and it's also the fact that she cornered you in the toilet. And in a way, she was technically threatening you, saying like not to do it or like bad things will happen. I just don't understand it. It's like it's crazy how people who make themselves out to be the most holy are actually the devil in disguise. If anything's going to put you off church, it's people like her. And then even on the flip side, even if the woman was a bit bigger, like you don't go up to her and say stuff like that. You know, you basically calling her a massive fatty isn't going to make her want to lose weight. It's probably going to end up with her starving herself and putting herself in hospital. I want you to leave my salon. I'm asking you to please get out of my salon. Stop standing and combing your hair and leave. 
Get out. Being, lady, being, lady, I don't think you mean. get it. I'm not being mean. I'm asking you to leave my salon. Okay. I Goodbye. Well, obviously, you're not leaving. Stop brushing your hair and get out. That's what I want you to do. Stop brushing your hair and I'm leave brushing, my salon. Comb, brush, whatever. Get the f out of my goddamn salon now. Get out. You reek of alcohol. Get out of my salon. Get out of my salon. Here, take your purse and get out of my salon. Now, get out of my salon. What the what f did you just Get out do? of my salon. I'm telling you right now. I asked you to come. What the f salon. Go. Goodbye. You crazy. Oh my fruit. God, she's insane. You psycho. Get out of here. Get away from the door, crazy. Goodbye. Bye. Bye. Goodbye. Don't bang on my door or I'll call the police. Get out. Bye. God, bye. Goodbye. Call them. Please do. Good. Don't get yourself arrested because you're inebriated. Goodbye. I want you to leave. I asked you kindly to leave. I'm going to, uh, could you just go away? Okay. Lovely. Bye. 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 <laughs> Goodbye. Yep, yep. Bye. We really are looking at some crazies in this video, aren't we? And yet again, that's the second person who smacked a window. What's their issue with windows? A whole hour. I don't care about not what you're talking about, lady. Talking about you waiting a second. People don't feel good. Think this shit game. Ain't nobody playing no more. Oh, uh, you can shut up talking to me. Uh, uh, security don't scare me. Security don't scare me. Oh, uh, you can be quiet and do your job. Because clearly you're not doing that. Because I already asked to speak to management anyway. Waiting over an hour. Yeah, it's not letting me cancel it out. It ain't okay, so let me do you me to do it. That seems like a you problem. Okay, so she's been waiting quite a while, but you can understand it's annoying. However, you don't react like that. Alicia's a lot more calm and she's not acting how she was in the beginning. They can't cancel it, the main people? I think that woman was upset because basically she was waiting an hour for medication. Look, that is incredibly annoying. However, you have to keep in mind there's maybe a reason for that. Maybe they don't have it. Maybe they're looking for it. Maybe they're waiting for it to come in a delivery, etc. A lot of people who work in the pharmacy industry are overworked and underpaid. And they don't need people like you overreacting to making their day worse than it already is. Karen doesn't want the dog to bark. Okay, so apparently now Karen's are beefing with dogs. Forget humans and moved on to animals. You're asking me. You don't want my dog to bark. And then you ask me, do I live here? Right. Why are you asking me that? Because if you don't live, if you live here, park near your house. What are you talking about? If I don't live here, park near my house. If you live here, then you should park in front of your house. So you're going to tell me other dogs don't bark here? Not in front of my house, no. Oh, okay. So you it's own a dog. The, so you own the street? Yes. I you do? You own the street? It's not a public park. Okay, it, and so I live here. Then park, then park in front of your house. I don't need to. I can park wherever I want to. It's the shade here. Yes, I can. Who says not I can't? Not if your car, not if your dog is going to bark. We have other dogs. Oh. Going to set off all the dogs. Oh, it's going to, okay. All right. Well, if you go inside, he'll stop barking. How about that? Well, I don't have to go inside. Okay, well, he don't need to stop barking. Okay. Okay. Thank you. You got anything else? I don't care. Oh, call, you call Animal. You do, just do that. I hope you would. Please do, okay? You'll be on YouTube tonight. You know that, right? I mean, she is in a Carter Reacts YouTube video, so I guess in the end she didn't make it onto YouTube. Apparently, now it's illegal for dogs to bark. Do you reckon they're going to be moving on the cats soon? You know, cats are going to be banned from meowing. Guy was trying to clean up and do his job and encountered this racist, disrespectful Karen. Yeah. When doing your job goes wrong. See the garbage? Man. Get the garbage. 
Ma'am? And you throw it in the garbage can. Ma'am? Do you understand? You have a nice day. Dialect. You're a blow up doll. Ma'am. You're not even a human being. Ma'am. Shut the f Please have a nice day. Ma'am. I am leaving and shut the f up. I run you over with the truck. Ma'am, please. Okay, well, that's a crime. Like, what is wrong with these people? Why are they so angry? I know she's littering. Like, what is actually wrong with these people? This is insane. What's she grabbing? Okay, in the end she threw a trash bag at him, but why is she reacting like that? Look, I can understand having arguments with people falling out with people, not agreeing with people in public. However, you don't speak to people the way she did. You know, she was saying some very, very horrible, vile, racist words. I don't people to keep my cool out being jail. Well, exactly! It's like, I don't know how these people keep their cool. Maybe I've just got angry. She's bound to you right now, I'd be going from zero to hundred within the space of two seconds. See if a person spoke to me like that and I'd be over for them. They'd be in a coffin, I'd be in a jail cell. Okay, we're in a Mexican restaurant, and they're playing some good-ass music. Makes me want to dance. Where's the Karen? Is that the Karen with the baby? Don't think it is, no. Okay, so Karen gets triggered by them in a Mexican restaurant. But she is in a Mexican restaurant, she knows. So there's gonna be like a lot of Mexican culture. Oh, I think that's her. I love how they just ignore her. So apparently she wasn't happy about them playing Mexican music or playing the instruments. All I can say to that is tough. I thought they meant the first lady with the kid. I was confused. Honestly, I was with you. I was thinking, oh God, is that Karen going to throw the baby? It wasn't even about her. I like how they continued in their singing after Karen tried to yell at them. Honestly, that's the best way to go about it. Just ignore them. You know, let them scream and shout all they want. Just play the music louder. I mean, they sounded pretty good as well. Like, why is she angry about that? Of course she is. If you don't want to listen to a Mexican live band, don't go to a Mexican restaurant. Like, it really is quite simple. Well, anyways, guys, that's really fun to do there. That's some crazy Karens. We're definitely going to be looking at a lot more Karens in 2024. And I'm looking excited, but I'm also looking dreading it. Well, anyways, hope you all enjoyed this video. If you're the first, subscribe and see you all tomorrow for another video.